The new Nexus 7 begins sales today, even though we're still a bit early. Steve Ballmer speaks about their disappointments with the Surface RT, and if you haven't gone Android 4.3 on your Nexus, we'll teach you how. I'm Jaime Rivera. And listen, if you don't want to celebrate the fact that today is Friday, fine, I'll celebrate alone. This is Pocket Now Daily. Let's start today off with some interesting news as Android 4.3 is making it slowly to the masses. Some people have gotten it, some people haven't. And as it turns out, there are some hidden features that are being discovered like selective app permissions, which wasn't mentioned anywhere, but it seems that you have that option now. So stay tuned as this a hidden feature becomes unhidden by other people, and most probably will be finding new things. And if you're still struggling to get Android 4.3 on your Nexus device, hit the links in the description and we'll teach you how. Joe's video is pretty descriptive on how to get it done. Now let's talk about the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Aside from reports that it's not getting a fingerprint scanner, apparently Sammy hasn't really decided what size they're going to bring to this device. There's reports that the device is being tested in 5.5 inches, 5.7 inches, and 6 inches, and it begs to wonder why so late. I mean, they should already be building this phone, but anyways, which size do you prefer? Leave us a comment. And speaking of hot devices that are coming soon, we've got some leaked photographs of the Sony Onami being compared against the Xperia Z. There's a full gallery of the device being compared in the links down below, and as it turns out, there isn't much of a size difference. This new flagship smartphone looks pretty much like an Xperia Z, only it's got a 20 megapixel camera, so stay tuned as the rumors develop. Now let's talk about Microsoft. The Steve Ballmer just had an internal meeting with his team and reportedly, well, they talked about a lot of things, including the fact that Ballmer is extremely disappointed at the excess of inventory that they have with the Surface RT because it didn't sell well at all. As it turns out, this is part of the reason why they have almost $700 million in losses. And aside from that, well, he's also disappointed at the fact that Windows products aren't really selling well. So with all these bad numbers, it's interesting to see what's Microsoft's next move. And finally, for the hot news of the day, if you couldn't wait to get your hands on the new Nexus 7, well, retailers couldn't wait to sell it to you. And not even Google, they're already selling the tablet and you can bet we already got ours for our unboxing treatment. Links down below to watch Taylor Martin's video. And so far, as it turns out, the tablet is as beautiful as Google is boasting that it is. So that leads me to the question of the day. Are you ordering or getting this new Nexus 7? In my particular case, uh, it's not that I'm ordering. I already ordered the damn thing. So leave us a comment down below. What are you doing? Of course, as always, for an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on PocketNow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter at Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. See you next week.